Actor Ray Liotta, who created intense, memorable characters in films like Goodfellas and Field of Dreams and so many others, died today. He was 67. Our colleague Philip Palmer looks back on Liotta's long career. If you build it, he will come. Ray Liotta had many roles described as memorable, including his breakout work in the 1989 film Field of Dreams with Kevin Costner. Liotta played Shoeless Joe Jackson in the box office hit. The actor died in his sleep while on location shooting a movie in the Dominican Republic. The year after Field of Dreams, Leota starred as hustler turned mob rat Henry Hill in Martin Scorsese's classic Goodfellas. The film cast him opposite acting heavy hitters Robert De Niro and Joe Pesci. Really funny. What do you mean I'm funny? It's funny, you're a funny guy. Leota was remembered by many of his friends on social media today, including Lorraine Bronco, who played his wife in Goodfellas. She wrote, I can be anywhere in the world and people will come up and tell me their favorite movie is Goodfellas. Then they always ask, what was the best part of making that movie? My response has always been the same, Ray Leota. He was also memorable as the vengeful ex-convict husband of Melanie Griffith's character in Jonathan Demme's Something Wild. He earned a Golden Globe nomination for that role. He earned a Screen Actors Guild Award nomination for playing Frank Sinatra in HBO's 1998 film The Rat Pack. Leota's recent big screen roles included Noah Baumbach's Marriage Story and Alan Taylor's prequel to The Sopranos, The Many Saints of Newark. Leota worked in both film and television in his career. He said he saw the business has changed over the years with the division between the two mediums shrinking. The only way to beat them at the game is to play the game. You have to understand what it is and it definitely has changed and there are some great, great parts now. The kinds of movies that they're making are different uh, and the shows on TV that they're, uh, they're, they're making are different and really, really good with great people. The actor is survived by his daughter, Carson, who attended the 2016 SAG Awards with her father. Philip Palmer, ABC7 Eyewitness News.